strength in reverse. All right. You could be dealing with a Leo. <clears throat> someone is not someone is lacking confidence someone's not bossing up someone doesn't have the courage to fight or they're just giving up that's the overall energy what happened in the past someone might bat shit crazy you could be dealing with the sagittarius a fixed sign sagittarius but someone just lost their shit they lost their patience they couldn't have it anymore okay they weren't doing this anymore this is someone who's not ready to compromise not ready to cooperate this is someone who just does not want just went completely out of their heads all right Coming into the current situation, I do see that things are going to come into balance, okay? That things are getting balanced, there's going to be equal equal give and take, or things are getting balanced, okay? There is someone who's understanding, there is someone who's ready to work with you, or you're ready to work with someone, and you both have an equal balance, all right? This has been influenced by the Three of Swords in reverse. The good thing is that because someone is healing from a heartbreak, okay? There could be a third-party situation or there could have been a very painful breakup or someone who was going through a breakup, all right? But someone's coming out of that breakup. Someone's healing, all right? They've give, you've given someone time. They've given you time. You've healed. And that's why now the balance is going to be there, all right? What's on your mind is the Five of Swords. You could be dealing with an air sign. So this is a lot of mind games. Someone's playing mind games or you even feel that you need to stand up for yourself. You need to fight for yourself, okay? You need to fight back. And uh, this is just standing up for yourself, standing up through any mind fuckery or any mind games that anyone's playing. You need to put them to place. Why is all this happening? Because of the Queen of Swords in reverse. This is because someone's being very, very bitter. Someone cut someone out. This is someone who's very vengeful, okay? Someone's pissed off. This woman's very bitter and she's really pissed off, okay? She's angry. Could be a lot of vengeful. This could be an ex. I do think this this has to do with the next because we have a breakup here. Um, but yeah, someone cut someone out in anger, all right? And there was no communication. However, in the future, I see that you will be moving on to a peaceful resolution, all right? Things are going to get better and you're going to move into calmer waters. Now, I just need to know if you're moving away from this person or if this person is coming towards you. Could be traveling. All right, let's clarify the strength in reverse. Why is the strength in reverse as the overall energy? The Scorpio. Yeah, someone lost confidence. That's why they stopped talking. You have the page of pentacles in reverse. Could be dealing with a younger earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Clive for the page of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, someone was feeling very, very burdened. They were stressed out. They had a lot happening in a situation, right? So that is why. <clears throat> so we have the overall energy is someone gave up. Someone doesn't fight, want to fight for anything anymore. They don't have the confidence to fight for something anymore. That's why they stopped offering their pentacle. They stopped giving to this situation because it was becoming a very big burden. So someone wanted to relieve a situation. Bottom of the deck, we have the six of wands in reverse. No forward movement. Lack of public recognition. Something was not successful. Why is the temperance in reverse for the past? Yeah, someone who lost patience, they could have loved you a lot. You could be dealing with another water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Emotions were stabilized, but they lost their shit. Probably this is someone who waited for a very long time for you. Clarify the King of Cups. Yeah, probably this is someone who was waiting for you to leave a relationship or leave something, okay? And that's when... Yeah, so in the past, someone lost their shit, like I said, right? They just lost all their patience. This could be a water sign. This was someone who you really, really loved, or this person loved you very, very much. But they could have been waiting for a very long time for you to leave a relationship or leave a marriage or leave a committed uh, relationship, whatever have you. Care for the Six of Pentacles, please. Care for the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles as the current situation for Scorpio? Mm. So maybe... You're focusing on your money right now. Clarify the King of Pentacles in reverse. Right now, I think you're very, very focused on your money. I don't think you're in communication with this person. You're very focused on your money. You're focused on your... Um, um, you're, you're, you're looking, see, we have the king of pentacles in reverse, okay? This is someone who's very, very self-focused, okay? This is someone who's focusing on their money, their property, anything tangible, okay? Someone very self-focused, very self-obsessed, someone who's completely driven on making themselves better, okay? They don't really care. I think this is someone who's not really giving to love right now. This is someone who's very focused on their work. 
and there is someone who's been emotionally absolutely cold. So I think it's the King of Pentacles in reverse and the Queen of Cups in reverse, right? This could be one person or this could be two people. But according to me, this is one person. This is you probably shut off the love. You're working on yourself. You're giving yourself all the focus. You're working on your money. You don't have time for love and you're emotionally unavailable. You're shut. You're cold. You're not giving to this person anymore. Clarify the Three of Swords in reverse. Three of Swords in reverse. What is this healing about? Clarify the Three of Swords in reverse. Yeah, see, like I said, healing from a breakup. Someone's healing from a breakup. This could have been a very strong soulmate connection. You have the two of cups. This was a very, very strong soulmate. Is a very strong soulmate connection. Okay, is. I'm not even saying it's a. Uh, it's it's not there anymore. You guys met eye to eye. You guys were on the same page. You guys loved each other a lot. But there could have been a lot of stress. Could be a third party involved. Doesn't have to be. But that's a lot of stress. Someone's coming out of that breakup. Someone's healing from that breakup. Why for the five of swords? Why is the five of swords on Scorpio's mind? Why is the five of swords on Scorpio's mind? Yeah. You think you need to stand up for yourself because someone's not communicating with you or you're just emotionally shut off. You know what? Okay, one more time. Clarify the page of cups in reverse. Let me clarify this one more time. Clarify the page of cups in reverse. Yeah. So... <clears throat> Maybe there was a lot of mind games. Someone is playing a lot of mind games. This is someone who wants to win under any cause. So this is someone who just likes to self-sabotage relationships, okay? Maybe you did this. Maybe someone else did this. And now you're emotionally shut off. You get a real picture, okay? You're not into that fantasy world anymore, okay? And maybe someone has a realization that they don't want to do this lovey-dovey. They don't want to live in a fairy tale anymore. They've stopped communicating. Stopped those lovey-dovey messages. They've stopped flirting. They've just stopped talking, communicating. It could be because they do, they want to be out of conflict, okay? They want to release this tension or they just don't want to fight for this anymore. Clarify the five of wands. Let me clarify this. Why is the five of wands in reverse here? Yeah. They don't want to fight for this anymore, okay? Because there are a lot of secrets. A lot of things are hidden. This is someone who's suppressing their deep emotions. Someone's come... I, yeah. So according to me, I think this is someone who does not want to fight for this anymore, okay? Because they think there's a lot of mind fuckery going on, a lot of mind games going on. They just don't know what's happening. This could be someone who's just very deceptive. Someone feels someone's being very deceptive. That's why they're shut down. And now they don't want to fight for this anymore. Could have been a lot of competition. Could have been a lot of fighting between you both. Maybe you both had to do a lot of fighting to reach to a situation. But yeah, things are hidden. The emotions are suppressed. All right. So, yeah. Emotions suppressed big time. This is someone who's just not hiding, not talking. Someone thinks that there's a, that is a, there, there are a lot of secrets involved, you know. Try for the Queen of Swords in reverse. Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse here? Try for the Queen of Wands. Try for the Queen of Wands. Try for the Queen of Wands. Okay, so someone cut someone off, could be the person who cut you off, right? Could be an air sign or you cut off an air sign because, because of the queen of wands. That could be a third party situation, like I said, right? So someone cut off someone, either who they were very, very passionate about and they really, really were very attracted to this person, but they think it was... It, it, it was going to be a disaster. So they just thought it's best, best to cut off this connection and avoid a disaster rather than face it. So I think someone cut some of them off because they don't want to take action. They're very passionate about this person, but they cut them off because they're trying to avoid the disaster. Try for the tower in reverse. Why is the tower in reverse? What is this tower they're trying to avoid? What is this tower in reverse? What is the tower in reverse? Yeah, see, that's why things aren't moving forward because someone just cut someone off. Whoever they cut, they were very, very passionate about this person. They looked at this person with a lot of passion and love. But they don't, but they want to avoid a disaster from happening. They think things will just be like, things will just come crashing down. And that's why there's no forward movement. Or maybe they just saw this wasn't moving forward. All right, let's clarify the Six of Swords. What is the Six of Swords? What is the Six of Swords, please? Yeah, someone's moving forward. They're not stressed about this anymore as much as they were earlier. We have the Nine of Swords in reverse. Why is the Nine of Swords in reverse? 
Yeah. Someone wants to return. <laughs> Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. This is someone who was trying to avoid the entire situation earlier, but now they're moving forward. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse, please. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Please clap for the seven of swords in reverse. Hmm. So, what you will be experiencing in the near future is someone's going to move into, someone wants to move into Kama waters. That is someone who's, but they're not even stressing so much about it, okay? This is someone who wants to return back. Someone who's feeling guilty. Maybe because they lost their shit in the past, right? They're feeling guilty that they shouldn't have been so impatient. They're moving towards you. They, they they want to return back. If they were avoiding you or they were ignoring you, they're moving towards you again. This could be someone who who feels they have a loss of control. Could be a control freak. Could be someone who just doesn't who felt there was they, they they lost control of the situation. This is someone very very stubborn at the same time too. But I feel this is someone who doesn't want to change their ways. Right? Whoever you're dealing with could be the Emperor in Reverse and Aries. Or this is just someone who's plain very, very stubborn about their ways. My way or the highway kind, you know. But they're returning to you. It's more like the return of the emperor. Yeah, bottom of the deck, we have the ten of swords in reverse. Okay, the worst is done. The worst is over. This is someone who's trying to have like an upheaval. Okay, this is someone who's trying to build from scratch with you. They're trying to recover from the pain. Okay, there was a painful ending between you guys. There was a... There was an ending to a painful cycle. This was a painful breakup, but now someone wants to come back. Yep, hundred percent. Someone wants to come back, and they're going to communicate with you. This is some exciting communication coming in, right? Someone's coming back, guys. The emperor's returning. All right. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please leave, uh, please leave your comments below and like, share, follow, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.